What's up, guys? Joe Kong 94 today, and today I'll be showing you guys how to put uh, Cody on your Amazon Fire Stick December 2017 update. The exact same thing as last time, but I figured I'd do another video since I have to do a bunch of these for people for Christmas. Which, again, if you do know me in person, um, I will do them for you. Just let me know. Anyways, go down to Device, Developer Options, and turn both these on. This part is very important. If you don't do this part, it won't work. Go back, go over to Applications collect data and turn that off you don't really have to do that I always just do and if I'm going too fast just pause the video you know I'll try to go a little slower this time you're gonna type in ES Explorer right there and this is gonna let you access uh, the Kodi site and download it I'm going to pause it just for a second while it loads. Okay, once it's done installing, just open it. And you're going to get this stupid message in a second. Just uh, close it out when it comes up. Hit the back button on your remote right there. Well, you can't really see it, but the button looks like a back button. It's pretty simple. You're going to go down to where it says new. And you're going to do web page, and it's going to be HTTP Cody.tv. Sorry, colon forward slash forward slash Cody.tv. And it will be on the screen too. Hit next. Go down, go over to OK. Want to go all the way down? Just choose Android. Doesn't matter. Any of these you can choose for right now. Keep going down. Keep going until you see where it says all the releases, and then choose where it says click here. You're gonna go to Android, ARM, and then do the very first one because that'll be the most recent one. And if it doesn't work. Like it doesn't usually work, you're gonna have to go down and then go over to where it says those three little dots in the bottom of the screen right there. Tap that, open in browser, choose ES Explorer just once or always, doesn't really matter. And that will start downloading it. And I'm gonna pause it and I'll see you guys when it's done. Okay, so now we'll say um, open folder, open file, do file. By the way, this is works for a, um, a Fire TV, which I'll show you guys in a second. Go to install. Go down, hit install, install again. And um, like I said, it will work the exact same process for the Fire TV, which you can't see, but you know what I'm talking about. The bigger one, that's a square. Uh, I wasn't sure, but it, it's the exact same process um, because I have two of those I did and I have three more of these to two for people. So um, yeah, but I'm gonna let this install. I'm gonna pause it and I'll see you guys when it's done. This is what I'm talking about by a Fire TV, by the way. Anyways, once it gets to here, you're just going to go down to where it says open and let it load. And again, guys, you know, it's really easy to do this, so just do it yourself. But if you do know me in person, like work with me or one of my friends on Facebook or something that lives near me, I'll gladly do this for you guys. Just uh, get in contact with me. Anyways, go to the settings. You're going to go down to file manager and you're going to type the link that I always forget. Um... And it will be in, on the screen, but I believe... Let me double check. Okay, guys. So that's what you want to type in. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash no limit builds um, dot com forward slash Cody. And it will be on the screen towards the bottom too. But anyways, just name it Cody. doesn't matter. Go back. You want to go to system settings. Go all the way down to where it says... Um, It says standard. You're going to tap on that until it says expert. Let me uh, pause it and fix the lighting. Hold on one second, guys. There we go. Sorry about the lighting. I had the stupid Christmas tree on. Anyways, you're going to go down to add-ons. Go down to unknown sources. And hit yes. And go to running. 
Click those three dots. Install from zip. Cody. And then do plugins.nolimitwizard. Once you see it's installed back there, you're gonna go back to the main menu, go down to add-ons, no limits. And by the way, if you guys are updating your build, it will be the exact same thing. Like when you have it installed, I'll show you guys what I mean. It will say update build and this is the screen you get. Just choose whatever you want. Um, I've been doing no limits, the fire stick for fire sticks. It actually works a lot better than the previous video where I did this. But if you have the newer fire stick, you can do that. But I'm gonna do this one. Um, and then just let it do its thing. And it's gonna go through it and then it's gonna ask you to unplug the power. So I'll pick it up when it gets to there. All right guys, so once it's done, it's going to come with this. And once the countdown's done, you just unplug it and plug it back in. Um, I don't know if I can film that and do it at the same time. Sucker. All right, so unplug it for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Plug it back in and it will come back on. Now guys, just to keep in mind, this whole process shouldn't take you more than 15, maybe 20 minutes. It's going to take me longer because I'm explaining everything to you guys. And Alright guys, so I don't know exactly where it cut out because I got a phone call. Um, I have a friend coming over for pizza and wings. Anyways, once you um, reboot your, or your not computer, your uh, fire stick, you're going to go to settings for the first time and you're going to go to applications. Now, after you do this, it should eventually screw up on your home screen so you don't have to do this part but if not you have to go to cody every time i did this for somebody and then they didn't realize that you have to go to cody every time and they just started buying things and had to pay for it but go to launch application if and it worked if it worked i'm sorry if and it worked i can't speak right now but if it worked it should uh have the no limits build if not just do the fire stick light again sometimes you have to do it a couple times um i've had to do it like you no know, two three times before it takes but looks like it's worked this time and if you guys ever have problems, comment in the um, comment section and I'll help you guys. But um, generally, you know, it just, it works first time usually. But sometimes you have a problem. And if it does, usually just wait a few hours and then try it again. It should work. Sometimes the site gets down. But anyways, guys, that's basically it. Um, it's going to eventually come up here and say updating skins. And then once it does that, it'll start showing like, you know, TV shows and movies right there. But you have your movies, your TV show, your adult section if you wanted it, your live TV sports um all that kind of stuff and that's basically it guys um so i hope you guys like this video if it did help you at all please share it with your friends and um by the way the no limits build now automatically does maintenance i'm pretty sure so you don't get that thick with that but if you like the video please give it a thumbs up comment below and subscribe share it with your friends and uh yeah i will see you guys next time joy kong 94 out